Could there be an enormous world lurking in our midst? Astronomers are increasingly certain that there is a ninth planet orbiting the sun far out beyond Neptune, a so-called planet 9. It would not be the first time that the roll call of the sun's orbiting worlds has been tweaked. When Ceres, the largest asteroid in the solar system, was discovered in 1801, it was initially classified as a planet, but later downgraded. Pluto too was admitted into the Planet Club upon its discovery in 1930, only to be asked to leave in 2006 and relegated to dwarf planet status. Caltech researchers found mathematical evidence suggesting the existence of this Planet 9, also known as Planet X, deep in the solar system. This hypothetical Neptune-sized planet orbits our Sun in a highly elongated orbit far beyond Pluto. The object, which could have a mass of about 10 times that of Earth, could orbit the Sun about 20 times further on average than Neptune. It may take between 10,000 and 20,000 Earth years to make one full orbit around the Sun. This announcement, however, does not mean that there is a new planet in our solar system. The existence of this distant world is only theoretical at this point and no direct observation of the object, nicknamed Planet 9, have been made. The mathematical prediction of a planet could explain the unique orbits of some smaller objects in the Kuiper Belt, a distant region of icy debris that extends far beyond the orbit of Neptune. Astronomers are now searching for this predicted planet. The first clues that there is, another member of the Sun's planetary fraternity came in 2014 when American astronomer Dr. Scott Shepard found a small dwarf planet candidate called 2012 VP113, orbiting an average of 250 times further from the Sun than the Earth. Its elongated orbit, which is significantly tilted relative to that of the planets, immediately stood out. Nothing is currently known in the solar system that would create 2012 VP113's orbit, said Shepard. While a few unusually aligned objects could be dismissed as an unlikely coincidence, now a total of 10 have been discovered, largely thanks to works done by astronomers Dr. Mike Brown and Dr. Constantin Batigan at the California Institute of Technology. With all of these objects sharing similar orbital properties, the chances of their alignment being a fluke drops to just 0.0001%. The leading explanation is that there is an otherwise unseen planet herding these objects within its gravity. Dr. Shepard was 60% sure that a ninth planet existed back when he found 2012 VP113. Now he says he is almost 85% certain. Yet, for the planet to be acting in this way, it would have to be 10 times more massive than the Earth, take at least 10,000 years to orbit the Sun, and sit over 200 times further out than our planet. This enormous distance makes hunting it down and photographing it quite tricky. For us to see Planet 9, light has to trek all the way out there from the sun and almost all the way back again, fading all the while. But astronomers have been able to narrow the search using several clever shortcuts. For example, data from the Cassini mission to Saturn was used to rule out parts of the outer solar system. If Planet 9 was indeed in those areas, then the probe would have picked up small gravitational discrepancies. There was a small setback in September 2018 when new research showed that another technique for ruling out parts of the sky wasn't feasible. But the hunt goes on. So far, we have covered about 30% of the prime area that the planet could be in, says Shepard. It may take another four years to cover the rest. 
Assuming this planet-like object really does exist out there, Planet 9's mass would most likely be a magnitude of roughly 10 times greater than Earth's, with the girth approaching the range of one of our ice giants. A likely scenario explaining the body's far-flung position puts its origin somewhere between the orbits of Neptune to Jupiter, with a birth much like any of the other gas planets in our solar system. Before it could gorge itself, Planet 9 would have received a kick from the gravity well of one of the two gas giants and found itself among the icy wastes. In spite of its large, slow orbit, enough time should have passed since the dawn of the solar system for it to have cleared its orbit of frozen chunks of dust and rock, earning the stunted gas ball an officially planetary title. Alternatively, though vanishing less likely, Planet 9 could be an adopted child snatched away from another passing star long, long ago. So cool, right? Endless possibilities. If you like this video, do subscribe to our channel and check out more of our content. Share this video with your swallow face geeks. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.